school. Happy Monday, and here is the news. Don't forget Monday, January 15th. There will be no school due to Martin Luther King's birthday. Are you looking forward to that day? If you lost your stuff and don't know where it is, you might want to check. You might want to check Mrs. Cerullo's office. They have a lost and found there. This is a reminder for Mr. Cerullo to keep your IDs at all times and not to be in the hole to your lunch. Students, marking period two and soon. Be sure to submit any missing work and do your best in and out of the classroom. Also, midterms are right around the corner. Make sure you study to do well on the exams. Why was a type of fewer theater boards from New York City suburbs and major regions? It's safety concerns about Manhattan, of course, so you can serve. The great, the great white way sold 12.3 million tickets for the 2022 and 2023 season, and that was a 17 drop versus 2018 and 2019. The last few seasons before Broadway shut down because of the pandemic. According to the data, the Broadway news released last month. This is, made, this is a major concern for Broadway. In national news, Harvard University President Claudine Gray resigns due to comments she made while speaking before con- Congress about tension in the Middle East and protests here at home about the Israel and Hamas conflict. She will continue on as professor at the school. The entertainment news rage against the machine as public push for the third time. According to the Bank's job of Young and Bradwell in the Instagram post, a founding member addressed the school of Cancel Beach as part of a race public service. I don't want to string people or myself along any further. So while there has been some communication that this may be happening in the future, I want to let you know that Tim, Zach, Tom, and I will not be touring or playing the live again. I'm sorry for those who have been waiting for this to happen. I really wish it, it was. Can that be it? We'll see. And now your dad joke of the day. Where do boats go when they're sick? To the boat dock. Daddy out. Today is going to be clear with some clouds per se. Eyes will only be around 41 and the lows in the 30s. I guess we'll take after the crummy weather we had over the It gets a little warmer tomorrow night. On this day in 1656, the oldest surviving commercial newspaper began. Known as the Harlem Dagblad, that's Harlem in the Netherlands, not the one across the river. Don't believe us? Look it up. That's all we have for now. Thanks for watching and have a great week. Thank you.